Hey guys, check out our latest construction project. It's epic. Just before we get inside the house, you're gonna look at some of the old moldings. Uh, they're original and they're in great shape. So if we need an old molding, hey, we got the original ones right here. It's a great idea and we highly recommend doing this. This is the old kitchen, and then we're gonna show you the old breakfast room, and then we're gonna show you both rooms having taken off the drywall. And what we're gonna be able to see is we're gonna be able to visualize the room being one large room, and we're also gonna be able to, to see exactly um, the kind of the innards or the construction that would potentially be needed. The goal is to move the existing laundry room to an area that is, I guess, less, desirable and to push the kitchen living area onto the backyard. We feel that that's a better modern way of living. It's gonna be spectacular, cannot wait. The dining room, which you're looking at, was perfect. We're not gonna to touch it. I mean, look at those beams. And then this, look at the fireplace, uh, and then this is the uh, living room also spectacular. We did have a problem with the fireplace. The gentleman we hired botched the job and we have to do it, redo it. Problem. We had a small office or TV room here. What we decided to do is take the drywall off and what we noticed is that we could push this room out. We could make it three feet larger um, easily. So we decided to take a small room and turn it into a nice sized room, a nice sized family TV room, again, spilling out onto the pool. Very excited for this room. Quick remodel of the existing bath, pushing the sauna out into the casita, which is in the backyard. I'm gonna spin you around here. You're gonna see two pipes out there, right there, right there. We're gonna take those out. Those were the original um, heating that um, came in through the basement. We're taking those out, which are gonna make us, um, which are gonna give us that three extra feet for that room. It's gonna be spectacular. Yeah, those pipes right there. Boom, boom, boom. Quick shot of the existing master, which is pretty spectacular, but I'm gonna tell you what's gonna make it even better. Here is the existing master. I'm gonna take you in. I'm gonna show you the closets. We're not gonna do anything to the master bedroom. Walk, 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 walk. So the closets, we started opening up so we could visualize um, the, their potential. So I'm gonna walk you, I'm gonna show you on this angle, and then I'm gonna take you around, and I'm gonna tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna open up those two rooms, and then this room that I'm gonna show you, we're gonna make this a bathroom. It's gonna be a nice size bathroom and it's gonna be a walk-in with a walk-in closet. Here's a shot of the master bath existing. It wasn't big enough. So let me take you in, let me walk you back in through the master bath. We reopened it and then we opened up the back side of it. We're gonna take a few feet from the, from the side that you can see, that you can see through to make the master bath ample. But then I'm gonna walk you to the next bedroom. Um, that is going to be the master bath. It's spectacular. It's a great idea. This is a shot when we bought the house where the bed, uh, the head of the bed, that's actually the new opening of where the bathroom is. Look at all of that beautiful light. And then you can see where we've removed a wall. And then I'm going to spin around and I'm going to show you the, the room that was there. So it was a teeny sunroom. Now I'm going to show you what both rooms looked like um, with the wall removed. Here's another shot of the potential future master. You can see how we took out that wall or we've taken out that wall already. And then we're also gonna give you a shot of um, where the, that's where the bathroom will be. Boom, boom, boom. And then we're gonna walk you over into what will be um, the master closet. And you can, you can really begin to see how much bigger it's gonna be and how appropriate it is for a proper master bath. Check it out, it's big. This room says, I'm a master closet. <laughs> this place is great. And just to show you one more time that the, the master will now overlook the backyard, which is, which is pristine and quiet and serene and um, filled with morning light. It's gonna be spectacular.
here's a shot of the third bedroom and quite frankly it's good to go uh we're gonna paint it up we're gonna put in lighting uh the bathroom we're gonna make a little bit larger but the bones are all there it overlooks the pool it's a really nice room look at those views oh i just love it <laughs> classic I know I said I was going to point out all of the issues of the house, but while I was making this video, uh, it, it, it just dawned on me how much I love this home. The bones are great. The energy is great. Um, so rather than getting into the negatives, I'll put the negatives in the comments. So read them. If you have other questions, comment and I'll get back to you. I promise. But check out the backyard. Check out my wife. Amazing. I'm the luckiest guy in the world, and I have to remember that.